Clarissa Shields versus Jake Paul. <laughs> this nigga Jake, man. Let's talk. Straighter. Yep. Not yep. a roundhouse right hand. And that's what we've been talking about. The straight shot. It's the one where he gets leverage on it. I don't want to kill Pull somebody back for a, a little bit. Seconds. Nah, I want a body on my record. Now, I want to see you fight motherfuckers. I do. All right? I'm with you. I'm with you. As long as as long as you're trying to fight the great, the, your, or the, the, the best competition. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we're here. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Sucker, bro. Real shit. Now, let me explain. Before um, Clarissa Shields lost in MMA, Jake Paul wasn't saying anything about nothing. Wasn't saying a motherfucking thing. You know, when, uh, when Clarissa Shields was asked, she didn't come out, she was asked about Jake Paul. You know, and she answered the way she answered. It is what it is. She's a fighter. That's what they do. I don't remember Jake Paul coming out saying nothing, nothing grimy about nothing. He hadn't, he didn't say nothing. He didn't give a fuck about anything. Oh, well, you know, we're signing the quote, um, Manny Serrano, and that's it. That's it. He just left it alone. That That's it. You had nothing to say about nothing. Everybody else was running around, oh, man, come on, man. I can't have if Clarissa Shields fights. Uh, if she fights Jake Paul, man, it's going to be this and it's going to be that. Oh, man, Jake, man, come on, man. Clarissa Shields and Jake Paul, come on, man. You could. Jake Paul wasn't saying anything. Everybody else was until she fought in MMA and lost in MMA. Then out comes Jake Paul with all this extra. You got all kinds of shit to say. Now you got all kinds of shit to say. Use a bitch, bro. And I actually liked this dude before. I ain't gonna cap. I actually like Jake Paul. I didn't have no beef for him. I like what he was doing. I like what he stood for. The fact that he was just like, fuck it. I'm, you know, he, he's out this motherfucker. He's paying these fighters heavy. He's paying them good. I was fucking with it. But use a bitch, dog. Will you wait until after? That's some sucker shit, bro. You wait until Clarissa Shields takes a loss and then all of a sudden. Let's just dive into reality, shall we? Let's get to reality. The reality of the matter. Clarissa Shields um, is nine months into a career that she's never done in her life. She's nine months into a, 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 a combat sport where she could get hurt, damaged. She can, get, she can get really hurt really fucking bad. She's nine months into this sport that she's never practiced. <laughs> and she's on a world level, in nine months in, on a world level, after completely and utterly dominating another, another a whole entire sport, still she is the example. In a whole entire other sport. Everybody in the sport of boxing. Everybody. Whether, oh, you know, I, I just want all, all, all. They all claim they want all the belts. They all claim they want to be that person, that one. She is the example. She is the only one. There is no one, no one that has done what she's done. No one. Undisputed in multiple divisions. 
you got to go back to when there was only one belt for to uh, to try to get that type of level of accolade. Or maybe two belts. No one has ever done what she's done. Ever. It's never happened. But yet now you got something to say because she went to a whole nother sport and lost to someone who's been doing this their entire life since they were seven. She lost to that person and didn't even lose badly. Didn't even lose badly. She was doing it for nine months. This person was doing it for 30 something years or 20 plus years, nine months versus 20 to 30 years. And you're, now you got something to say? Now you want to clown? <laughs> Use a bitch, bro. Use a straight bitch, bro. Use a bitch, bro. For real, for real. Jake Paul's a bitch, man. I, and again, I had no beef with the dude, bro. I was, talk your shit, do your stuff, do your thing. But now you want to clown? You Now you got all this vim and vigor. You got all this shit to say after she takes a loss? But before that, you were saying nothing? Use a bitch, bro. That's a bitch move. That's a straight up bitch move. Bitches do that. And I'm not talking about women. I'm talking about bitches. That's a bitch move, dude. You didn't have to say nothing. There was no... And if you was going to say something, you should have been saying it previously. She, didn't want, she wasn't downing you and shitting on you and disrespecting you. All she said is, bro, I'll beat this dude. And she said it about everybody. Or did you forget? She said she'll beat up Keith Thurman too. Did you forget that? I don't see Keith Thurman running around here saying all kinds of stupid ass shit then, before, or after. Like, nigga. And, I, and, I, and, and the crazy thing is, I wouldn't have had a problem if he said something then. I wouldn't. Would have had no beef. This is a combat sport. But the crazy thing is, <laughs> this woman is nine months in. <laughs> Dude. You legitimately haven't fought a boxer yet. You fought an NBA player. You fought a a a a, a two you a wrestler and a UFC a, an NBA player, a wrestler, and a UFC guy. Two UFC guys, one of them who's a wrestler. The best competition on your boxing resume is a UFC striker. That is the best competition on your resume. You can't be fucking serious, bro. You can't be serious. You're about to fight. Tommy Fury, a fucking nobody, a nobody nothing, that's what you're about to fight, Tommy fucking Fury, <laughs> what, there is no one that you fought, no one that has a better career, a better resume, better accolades than Clarissa Shields, Oh man, he fought. He fought uh, Tyrone Woolley. He's a multiple. Yeah, but he's never boxed. He's never switched over from one to a other and still had and still competed in one. Tyrone Woolley has one boxing match and he lost. <laughs> it, yo, I'm just sitting here like, yo, you guys, you can't be fucking serious, bro. You can't be serious. Do you realize who you're talking to? Do you realize the person, the level of person you're talking about? This is a two-time Olympian, a multi-division undisputed champion, the fastest to ever do it, the only one to ever do it, ever. I'm, I'm, I'm sitting here like, and, and you're, oh, wait, that's right here, you need to humble yourself. What? Humble? What? Who the fuck are you? Who are you? But you're talking about humble? This the guy riding around in the back of a fucking car, a back of a truck, throwing balloons at people? Karma is what he says, karma? This the guy that snatched somebody's hat? Well, not, you're the family member of someone that snatched somebody's hat. You're, you yeah, you did snatch somebody's hat and got punched in your shit. <laughs> and got, got your shit bust. This is the guy that says, oh, 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 oh. You have a no knockout clause in your boxing matches. <laughs> Bro, I don't even know what that means. I, you can't be fucking serious, dude. You can't be fucking serious. You can't be fucking serious. Well, you're fighting um a, a gay dude, Tommy Fury. You're fighting some fucking gay ass dude. 
DF won't be watching it. I swear to God on that. I don't give a fuck, bro. I, I won't be watching it. For what? Bro, you know when the next time I watch a Jake Paul fight when you fight an actual boxer? Yeah. Tommy Fury is not that. Tommy Fury is a gay model. When you fight an actual boxer, I'll watch that. Until then, I'm not watching nothing you do. This nigga on pay-per-view. Nigga, what? Pay these nuts? I ain't buying none. I, bro, get the fuck out of my face, bro. Get the fuck out of my face. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Get the fuck out of here. You are a bitch, my nigga. Straight up bitch. You could have been had. If somebody else talking about Jake Paul, he had all this kind of shit to say. I got all this to say and all this to say and all that to say. Clarissa wasn't talking about you. She was asked a question and she answered it. Then she's, I'm not signing with this dude. Why would she? Why Why would she? If, if this is the last I checked, this is America. And she can do what she feels like doing. The last I checked. She don't need to sign to you. Now, if you can get her a big ass fight, hold it for the story. But she don't need to sign to you. But I guess that, I guess you didn't like that. I, I, whatever, whatever. You're entitled to your opinion. You're entitled to, all, but but all that whack ass shit you talking about, bro. About what, bro? Come on, bro. You're you're nowhere near. You're not even in the building. There is levels to this, absolute levels. All right. You are not in the state, let alone the fucking county, let alone the city. Let let. You're not. You're not even. You're not the building. Clarissa Shield is a multi division. Undisputed champion, multiple gold medals in the Olympics. You have none of that. You beat Nate Robinson <laughs> in boxing because you damn sure ain't beat him in basketball. You you beat Nate Robinson in a sport that he's never competed in. That's what you did. Something that you've been training, you've been working on. He, his whole life has been basketball. Then you beat him and now you the goods. <laughs> Come on, dogs. Come on, man. You, you you was on a nice little roll. You know what I'm saying? You was doing doing your thing, making bread. You're still making money. But you was doing your thing. You know what I'm saying? There, there's no reason to go at some... Are you going to fight Clarissa? Is that what this is? Is all this, this you going at her? Is this something to set up a fight with her? Cause if you're going to set up a fight with it, fucking do it, and she'll beat your ass. Oh, she go, she go be. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna have to fight her at a catch weight. Fight her at a catch weight. Go to one. Go to one sixty. <laughs> Drop down from fucking two hundred, from one ninety two hundred to one sixty, and fight Clarissa Shields. She will beat your motherfucking ass. I don't give a fuck what anybody says. She will beat the dumb shit out of you. You are not a better puncher. You're not a better striker. You're not none of that. And when you drop all that weight to meet her at 160, you will not be as strong as you are at cruiserweight. Yeah, she will beat the shit out of you. I don't care what y'all say. I do not care. Clarissa Shields will beat the dumb shit out of this nigga. She will beat the fuck out of this nigga. Will he be fast? Yes, he will. She will be at her natural weight striker. She will beat the shit out of this nigga. Faster, everything that she's been doing her entire life, there it is. So you've been fighting, you fought Nate Robinson, who has been doing, who's a basketball player his entire life. Clarissa Shields is a boxer her entire life. So if all this conversation that you whack ass shit you're doing is set up a, a, a future boxing match, cool. I know the motherfuckers are like, oh no, I don't want to see that shit. Hey man, I don't give a fuck. If y'all motherfuckers want to fight, fight. Don't matter to me. I didn't see bitches fighting niggas before. Don't matter to me. And she'll beat your ass. And I don't give a fuck what anybody says. And I and I believe that. I believe she will beat his ass. At 160, 168, she'll beat the shit out. Cruiserweight and all that other shit, hold it for story. Because he'd be way bigger than her. Pretty sure people going to be like, oh, no, BFTP, no. Oh, my God, no, no, no. No, 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 Otherwise, this nigga needs to shut the fuck up. If you ain't gonna fight her, shut the fuck up then. What, what's your point? What, what is your point for going at her? She didn't go at you. She answered the question. So what is your point for going at her if you're not going to fight her? What's your point? And again, she'll beat your ass. BFTB.
Shout out to the LDBC, and I'm out.